what is meiosis meiosis is a process by which diploid cells are reduced to haploid cells it is a process by which gametes are produced in case of males sperms are produced while in case of females ova or the eggs are produced what will happen if there is no meiosis if there is no meiosis during each generation the number of chromosomes will be doubled if a cell if a cell has 2n chromosomes during the next generation it will become 4n from diploid to tetraploid and in the third generation it will become 8n so uh, it is necessary that during the meiosis the number of chromosomes should be reduced so meiosis is a process that reduces the number of chromosomes if the number of chromosomes will not be reduced the individual or the zygote will not survive and the individual will uh, die meiosis is a two step process meiosis 1 and meiosis 2 there is only one duplication of the chromosomes that is at the start of the meiosis 1 during interphase while in meiosis 2 there is no duplication of the chromosomes meiosis in males is called as spermatogenesis while the meiosis in females is called as oogenesis as a result of spermatogenesis sperms are produced while as a result of oogenesis ova eggs are produced if we take the example of the spermatogenesis in case of males in case of males there are primary spermatocytes Prim primary spermatocytes they are they contain 2n means 46 chromosomes as a result of meiosis 1 this primary spermatocyte is converted into two cells which are called as secondary spermatocyte in each of the uh, secondary spermatocyte the number of chromosome is reduced to 23 mean the number of chromosomes reduced to the half while as a result of meiosis 2 this cell again divides and the division is called meiosis 2 that is like the mitosis and cell divides into two daughter cells and this cell will also divide into two daughter cells so as a result of meiosis one cell produces four haploid cells these haploid cells in case of males they are called as sperms while on the other hand in case of females meiosis is called as oogenesis as a result of oogenesis there is a primary oocyte this is a primary oocyte that contains 46 or it can be 2n two set of chromosomes as a result of meiosis 1 this primary oocyte is converted into secondary oocyte one of the secondary oocyte and the second one is called as polar body each of these two cells contain 23 uh, chromosomes means 1n this it will be 1n and the polar body will also be 1n again as a result of meiosis 2 this cell will divide into two and the polar body will also divide into two this division mean the meiosis 2 will be like the mitosis and as a result of oogenesis one primary oocyte will be converted into four cells three of them they are called as polar bodies while one of them is the egg polar bodies that usually die and egg survives and egg contains 23 chromosomes or it is called as 1n so we can conclude that meiosis is a process by which diploid cells 
are reduced to haploid cells as a result a single cell that is uh, that is diploid will produce four haploid cells